Hey guys, J.O.Q. back here, and today this is going to be a 2 through 6 relay. Uh, this is sort of a, uh, also 50 subscriber special, because the other day I reached 50 subscribers, and since I wanted to talk about my comp results, I thought I could do this as a special and talk about my comp results over the subs. So of course at the comp, y'all of course know I did two through four, skewed, OH, and uh, para. So in three by three first round, I had did not so well. I believe I got a thirteen average, but I, that still got me to second round, which I was pretty satisfied with. Uh, two by two. All went well, sort of, in that event. I ended up getting an internal pop, pop on my Vault 2, and that got me a 7.16 single, which is really bad for me. But I got a 4.46 average, I believe, which is also not so good for me. Uh, I wish to improve in that event, uh, officially, of course, and... Uh, Hopefully I can get a better average next time. Uh, which uh, actually went pretty well. I um, I got a 27 average. And I ended up getting a 17 single. Which was really good for me. And is now second in my state. Right behind Zachary Walden I believe. 4x4. Uh, four four did not go very well at all. I ended up getting... A one minute average, which is absolutely terrible for a person at my speed, and was quite disappointing to get. Para first round, para means went pretty well actually. Uh, I got some pretty good solves, some fives, and I believe I got around a six average. Uh, skew, skew, and four by four's part was the worst. Skew, I ended up getting a 6 average. I was really nervous and I did not do well in the event. And, uh, but I still ended up getting to second round. Now on to second round for 2x2, two two, well not 2x2, two 3x3. Two, three pyramids and skew so and three by three round two uh at first i did fairly well uh but they ended up making a mistake where they messed up some of the scrambles so we had to go back up there to get to redo our solves and i had already finished i had a 12.52 average which was pr average that i was really happy about but of course i had to go back up there and resolve again so, after I did all my resolves and everything, I was really disappointed because I got a 12.99 average, which was not a PR average. And um, I was really disappointed because I had a good average before, but then they had messed things up, so I had to redo my solves. Then, uh, on to skew. Well, it was, wasn't was second round, it was key finals. I still did very poorly. I ended up getting a 5.1 average, I think. I uh, dropped a cube on what, what could have been a two second solve, which was really, really disappointing. I did honestly absolutely terrible in skew when I know I had the capability to do much greater in that event. Then Pyramid's finals did not go well. Uh, uh, when I wanted to solve, before I had saw somebody in 3 3 round 1, I believe they were able to wear their headphones and the judge didn't say anything. So I went up, I did two solves and I had my headphones in. Now on the second time, the judge had uh, said, hey, you're not allowed to have those in. That's a DNF. And then uh, he asked me if I... Warm on the first off, I also said yes. 
and said that was an also a DNF solve also, so I ended up getting a DNF average in Pyraminx, which was highly disappointing. So all in all, it was a sort of disappointing competition, but I still had lots of fun. I got to see some friends and everything, and I still had lots of fun there. And of course, not every single competition is going to be a good competition, and not every single competition am I going to podium at something. But uh, it was still a very nice comp. I got some pretty good results that I'm very happy about. And I just enjoy myself all, all in all. Okay, that's all I have for today. Thank you for 50 subscribers. I really appreciate all of you that are subscribed to me. And uh, hopefully I'll have some future competitions coming up. And... Uh, Thanks for watching my 236 relay and just hear me rant on how terrible my solves were. And I really appreciate it. This is JL Cubing signing out.